This is the extraordinary story of ancient New York. New York is a city of miracles that reaches for the sky. The Empire State Building, Wall Street, Times Square. America begins its year according to New York. The world counts its money according to Wall Street's ebbs and flows. Architect Glenn Leach has spent a lifetime studying the Statue of Liberty's structure. He was brought in after the attacks of September the 11th to re-examine the statue's security measures and to do what the ancients couldn't, to ensure his city monument survives the test of time. The Statue of Liberty has always had a special place in my heart. Uh, I grew up on Staten Island and I saw the Statue of Liberty hundreds of times taking the ferry and the fact that I worked on the Statue of Liberty and, and helped uh, modernize it and take it into the 21st century uh, was, uh, was a wonderful treat for me and something I'll always be pretty proud of. The Statue of Liberty is built around a box truss within the structure, so it's a, it's a long truss that sits on top of the pedestal, but is grounded within the pedestal, which actually makes it taller and more stable, almost like putting a stick into the sand so that there's more structure underneath. The pedestal acts more like a footing so that the statue has much more uh, strength. Symbolic images are important to a lot of cities. If you, you look at Rhodes, it had its uh, Colossus. The New York had its Statue of Liberty. I think it's a really important part of any great city is to have a, a symbol. 